Welcome Time Beat Breaking News Channel. Here are our breaking news today. 1. Oklahoma Sooners men's basketball coach Lon Kruger retiring after 45 years in coaching. 2. Tesla ordered to have Elon Musk delete anti-union tweet. Oklahoma Sooners men's basketball coach Lon Kruger retiring after 45 years in coaching. Oklahoma men's basketball coach Lon Kruger is retiring after 45 years in coaching, it was announced on Thursday. Kruger, 68, has been in charge of the Sooners for the last decade, leading them to seven NCAA tournaments and a Final Four appearance in 2016. They finished 16-11 overall this season, going 9-8 in the Big 12 and advancing to the second round of the NCAA tournament before losing to Gonzaga. Prior to taking over at Oklahoma, Kruger led UNLV to four NCAA tournament appearances in seven seasons, including a Sweet 16 run in 2007. Considered one of the more underrated coaches of his generation, Kruger started his coaching career in 1976 as an assistant at Pittsburgh State. He spent time as an assistant at Kansas State before becoming head coach at Texas Pan American. Kruger was also the head coach at Kansas State Florida, and Illinois, and also spent three seasons as the head coach of the Atlanta Hawks and a year with the New York Knicks as an assistant. Overall, Kruger was 674 to 432 as a college head coach, went to 20 NCAA tournaments, and made two Final Four appearances. He's one of just three coaches to lead five different programs to the NCAA tournament, along with Rick Pitino and Tubby Smith. His track record of successfully rebuilding programs everywhere he coached is made even more impressive when considering how he did it, Oklahoma Athletic Director Joe Castiglione said in a statement. He won with integrity, humility, class and grace. He did it with superior leadership skills and a genuine kindness that included his constant encouragement of everyone around him. Kruger's son, Kevin, was recently named the head coach at UNLV. Sources told ESPN that it had an impact on Kruger's decision to retire. With Kruger's departure, both basketball jobs are now open at Oklahoma, with longtime women's coach Sherry Cole having announced her retirement last week. Tesla ordered to have Elon Musk delete anti-union tweet. The National Labor Relations Board has decided that Tesla violated labor laws when it fired a union activist and when CEO Elon Musk wrote on Twitter in 2018, nothing stopping Tesla team at our car plant from voting union. Could do so TMRW if they wanted. But why pay union dues and give up stock options for nothing? Among other things, the federal agency has directed Tesla to ask Musk to remove his offending tweet and to offer a job back to the terminated employee, Richard Ortiz. Tesla must also compensate Ortiz for loss of earnings, benefits, and adverse tax consequences that resulted from his firing. The employee was part of an organizing campaign, Fair Future at Tesla. At the time of the campaign, Tesla said its business should stay union-free. But Musk's public comments on his Twitter account, where he has tens of millions of followers, were seen as threatening. Tesla considers Elon Musk tweets to be official company communication, as disclosed in its financial filings. Tesla will also have to revise a confidentiality agreement it gives to employees as a matter of course. The company previously told employees they were not allowed to speak with media without explicit written permission. However, national labor law generally protects employees when they speak with the media about working conditions, labor disputes, or other terms and conditions of employment, the NLRB noted. Thursday's decision was largely in line with one from September 2019 by an administrative law judge, who had considered the complaint before. Tesla appealed that all the way to the full board. Thank you for watching, we help you stay up to date all the news hourly, please subscribe our channel to follow up the latest one.